Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about some of the tips and tricks that MSB has that you might not know about. So let's get into the video. So the first tip slash trick on my list is lag free. So if you don't know what lag free is or being on hide, it's technically and basically where all of the MSP users on the bottom of your screen just disappear. So that causes you to have less lag because you don't have the status updates, you don't get the shared art books or the shared movies or the shared forums, you don't receive messages, like you still receive them but they don't pop up on your screen. Which therefore stops some of the MSP lag that we all hate. So to do this, all you have to do is go up to the Movie Star Planet logo in the far left corner of your screen and all you do is click it. And as you can see, all of the movie stars and everything is just gone which is making my game not laggy. Um, another thing you can do to avoid lag is if you want to have like a moving animation such as this, if you leave this running for a long period of time your game is going to slow down and start lagging. So if you want to stop that you can choose the animation that you want so I'm gonna go with this one and all you do is save the animation like that and then you switch back to an ordinary animation that doesn't move so I'm gonna go with this one and just don't save it it just stops moving and it stops the lag so there you go if you didn't know about those two tricks tips whatever they are now you do moving on to the next tip slash trick the next tip slash trick is how to edit your looks so to edit your look, basically all you have to do is go to Movie Town, you go to Looks, and I'm not going to create one because I can't be bothered to download the app on my phone and whatever, but technically all you have to do is either make a new look or use an old look, and let's say I wanted to remove the fishnets from this look, all I would have to do would be go onto the app and from the app you go to movie town you click on looks and then there's going to be a little pencil by the side of your look and all you have to do is click on the pencil and remove the item of clothing that you don't want and yeah that's how you do it so there you go nice simple trick if you don't want to have to recreate the look all over again the next tip slash trick is technically you know how when you have accessories on on your character but you want to change your face but you can't change your face with the accessories on because you don't know how it looks like maybe you have these eyelashes on and you can't really see what the eye makeup looks like there's a very simple trick to this without you having to go back into your wardrobe and having to let's say take off the accessories and then put them back on which can be very tedious especially if your accessories are like in the back of your wardrobe and you have to go refine them again so an easy way to do this is to go into beauty clinic and then you just click on the accessories and they disappear then you click and they come back you click they disappear you click and they come back I didn't know about this until my previous video or like I don't remember which video it was I think it was giving pixie star a makeover um, in my comments people were telling me about this so I didn't even know about this so maybe you guys didn't but if you didn't now you do and I'm sorry my voice sounds really weird I just woke up and I'm trying to be energetic but it's not working out for me moving on to the next tip slash trick so have you ever wondered why and how could you save time by sharing your movie because honestly it's really tedious if you have to, I don't know, click on your movie and share it manually. Especially if you have a lot of friends like I do. Not a lot of my friends are online right now, but in the prime hour of MSP, there are a lot of people online for me and I really cannot be bothered to click every single one of these 
it makes me lag, it, it's just time consuming and honestly it's really boring. So there is a way you can simply send it to everyone without having to do it manually. All you have to do is go into edit the movie, you do that by clicking the pencil and the pen, the pencil and the paper, sorry, and you click on that, which is edit movie, then you get into the movie screen where you can edit your movie and all you have to do is click save. And once you click save, it's going to share to every single one of your friends and that way you don't have to manually send it. Moving on to the next tip slash trick. Has your MSP ever frozen and you're like screaming at your computer screen because you have to reload, which takes forever, especially if your computer isn't the best. Loading up MSP can take a long time and again, is really time consuming. However, there is a way to get rid of the freeze Unfortunately, I haven't been able to make my game freeze. My game just lags really badly, but it never seems to freeze. But if your game does freeze, <clears throat> there is a way to stop it from being frozen. All you have to do is... I have a Mac, but this works with any computer, even Windows. You know at the top of your screen you will have the Movie Star Planet tab on your browser. Then there will be like a plus sign to add a new tab. All you have to do is click the plus sign, add a new tab, and once you've added a new tab, you click back onto the Movie Star Planet tab, and your game will be unfrozen, and yeah, you can carry on with your MSP day like nothing happened, without having to reload all over again. Another tip slash trick for MSP is, well, I don't know whether this is a tip or a trick, I think it's more of a tip, but... If you want to level up quickly and you're a low level, I'd say from about like level 0 to level 25, which isn't a low level, 25 is quite high. If you want to somewhat level up quicker, all you have to do is buy 10 pets. Now I know this can be very costly, however, you can buy 10 of the cheapest pets and you put them in your room. In your status you can write 10 pets in my room, whatever, you know, what all the high scorers do. People will potentially pet your pets and each time someone pets one pet you get 10 fame. So if you have 10 pets and someone goes into your room and pets all 10 pets, you get 100 fame. So bearing in mind, if you're on fame boost and somebody goes into your room and pets 10 pets, you are going to get 200 fame each time somebody does that. So, knowing this, if you're a lower level, what you can do to level up really quickly is make several different accounts and go into your room and pet your pets. You can either be on fame boost on your main account or you can be not on fame boost and just earn half, but I'd recommend being on fame boost, especially if you're trying to level up as low level if you have VIP, if you don't then obviously you can't go on fame boost but I would recommend being on fame boost and if you think about it if you have if you make let's say just 10 just 10 noob accounts um, you get 500 no you get 1000 fame if you're on fame boost you get 2000 and if you like ask people in messages to go pet your pets, usually they will because it's um, a benefit. A benefit. Uh, blah blah blah. It's a benefit for them and for you. So they earn money, you earn fame. It's it's a I don't know. It's a good swap. It's a good trade. So yeah, there's a little tip for you guys if you want to level. I personally don't do that. I do have ten pets in my room, so if you guys want to go pet them, you can. But again, I don't really care about leveling anymore because I've been playing this game for way too long and I'm still level 36. But unfortunately, I just don't really care about leveling anymore. But yeah, there you go guys. That was a little tip for y'all. This next tip requires me to log back into MSP. So this next tip is how to send the same message several times. So... You know, maybe you're trying to like, I don't know, 
advertise your latest movie, your latest art book, and there's a really easy way to do this. Maybe you guys already know. If you don't, then yeah. So all you want to do is click on as many chats as you want. So you can just open several chats up, which I'm doing right now. And all you have to do is take these chats. Like you could have like 20 chats open. And all you have to do is write the message, please watch my, oh god, I, can you see, I'm already lagging, my latest movie, thanks. And you can just do, you can just write whatever you want, and then all you want to do is, like, highlight this. You could copy and paste it manually, but I just highlight this and all you want to do on your keyboard is press command C and this is going to copy your message then you can just hit send on your message and then on the next chat you want to press command V and as you can see it's copied the last thing that you wrote in the chat so that way you're not losing any time it's pretty quick and yeah it's a simple way to just kind of somewhat spam people and I know that people hate spam but if you want to advertise something and you want all your friends to watch it then that's a good way to do it. So anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video Um, there might be some other tips and tricks that I don't know about and if you know about them then go ahead and write them in the comments of this video and help people out because, you know, that's what this community needs. We all need to help each other level. We need to help each other, you know, kind of just play the game. Because MSP isn't the simplest of games. Sometimes it can be not difficult, but the game itself with leveling and owning star coins can be quite difficult. So, yeah, make sure to hit the like button if you like this video and you want to see more informative videos or even just fun videos. And yeah, I love you guys. I'll see you in my next video. Make sure to subscribe because we're going to hit 9,000 very soon. And yeah, I'll see you very soon, guys. Bye-bye.